Well, joining us now to talk more about this tragedy, Evansville Mayor Lloyd Winicky. Uh, Mayor Winicky, thank you so much for being with us. I know your time's very valuable. My pleasure. Thank you. Oh, well, Mayor, what are investigators telling you right now about what may have caused this explosion? Well, the investigative portion of the um, of the situation is um, still underway. I know they removed the uh, gas meters from the residences that were affected, and those are now part of the uh, investigative investigative process. And uh, they they don't know yet is the bottom line. And and there was that explosion happened you know within the past five years. Any concern that this is all connected? Uh, that would be, I would say, uh, without knowing exactly what happened here yesterday, I would say it's unlikely that the two are related. Uh, it's a coincidence. It's about an eight block uh, walk from here. Um, in, that, in that case, two people uh, lost their lives. Uh, this blast, uh, even though one more one more person died, the, the, the blast feel and the damage in the surrounding neighborhood is much greater in this situation. Uh, as you noted earlier uh, in the story, 39 homes. Uh, were damaged in about a 100-foot radius. This happened on one of Evansville's uh, very busy streets, actually, Weinbach Avenue. So it is a miracle that there weren't uh, more fatalities. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.